Mailbox mayhem. A vandal damages two dozen of them in and around Muskego. Our Brett LeMoyne is live tonight with the reason the suspect should have reason to worry. Brett? Yeah, well, Ted and Stephanie, in the neighborhood impacted the most, there are lots of doorbell cameras there. And police here are sharing some of those videos tonight in hopes other homeowners check their footage and help catch the culprit. It's a sound that repeated over and over again early Saturday morning. I'm kind of one of the lucky ones, if you want to say it. <laughs> Chris Dussold just came home from vacation to find his mailbox knocked off its post. Hawks Trail got hit bad, and I haven't had a chance to go over and see it yet. In total, Muskego police say 24 mailboxes were destroyed or damaged around this subdivision off Durham Drive. We've been here now 19 years, and we haven't even had the problems with the snowplows. Until now, investigators say it's clearly intentional. Surveillance cameras caught a pickup truck going up and down the neighborhood toppling mailboxes with its plow. Muskego police believe the same suspect hit other homes across the county line in Franklin the same morning. Why would they do it? You know, having some fun, I guess, at somebody's expense. Homeowners in this neighborhood are all required to have the same style mailbox. Dussold says it will cost $500 to replace. Until it gets fixed, postal workers say mail won't be delivered. It'll be held at the post office instead. The impact to this subdivision will likely be felt for weeks. I hope you enjoyed yourself, and, uh, and if you're caught, I will make sure that you are prosecuted to full extent. Now, if anyone has any information about these crimes, you're asked to call Muskego Police. They're especially looking for any videos. As we said earlier, we did file an open records request with Franklin Police about the damage done there. We haven't heard back. Reporting live in Muskego, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. If caught and convicted, I imagine the price of restitution is going to be a pretty penny for that culprit. All right, Brett, thank you.